Hey, Jason Nyback here from SnowballSecrets.com. Head over there after this video and I want to give you a video to show you how to get massive amounts of visitors to your site on total autopilot using the Snowball traffic system that I've used to get over 1.2 million visitors to my site. So head over there. Now, on this video, I want to talk to you today about getting more backlinks. The bottom line is if you want to get more traffic to your, to your site, in your niche market, you want to dominate it, get top 10 rankings, so on and so forth, you need backlinks. Here's the problem. The evolution of backlinks has changed a lot and continues to evolve. The problem is most people don't understand this and they're stuck in a backlinking like it's 2005. Here's the thing. You do not need 5 million backlinks to your site to get traffic. You don't. Here's the problem. Google, it doesn't necessarily uh, ban you if you get garbage backlinks, they just devalue them. Obviously, if you get really bad backlinks from like, from dark uh, neighborhoods, they're gonna not like that, might ban you from the search engines. However, if you just get a bunch of garbage backlinks from forum posts and so on and so forth that, I mean that they have good value in terms of traffic, but you know, the search engines are like, ah, you know, we figured this out. We don't really, there's no value on these links they're not necessarily going to get you out of the search engines, but what they will do is they'll just devalue those links. And so you're going to continue to have to get more junk links, more junk links to just make up for the junk links you have to hold the rankings that you have, which keeps slipping because you're not spending all your time getting new links. So the best way I think to get good backlinks is a couple options. The first thing you need to do is you still can get some good backlinks from writing articles and you can put those articles on different directories. You just gotta make sure the directories have do, follow, that have do follow or that they don't have no follow tags, right? Because here's the thing, there's still good traffic on those directories. Now, in getting traffic from article directory or backlinks from article directories, you gotta make sure your article is unique because Google's pretty smart. If you, they know you've got one article that you've pumped out to 14 million article directories, and you just got the same backlinks, they're gonna figure that out. So make sure you have unique content for every directory you use. It's very cheap. I pay about three bucks an article, get really good articles written by my outsourcers, and you can do that. I found that to be very helpful. Now for targeted keywords though, for really competitive ones, I like the whole strategy of link baiting, and in a good way. How that works is you create a widget or create a little something in your market, get it out there on Twitter, get it out there on Facebook, wherever, on forms, and people can download it. It might be a tool to help them do something better. And then you just have it linked to a page on your site, and then that gets viral. Lots of people are like, hey, look at this little tool I got that shows me you know, how to train my dog type thing. And you get all kinds of links back to your site, and those are usually pretty good links. And so those are two really easy ways to get a lot of traffic. So just make sure you do it right. Don't just do garbage links because you're just going to waste your time. See you on uh, snowballsecrets.com.